Welcome to Cooking with Scott. This is the final episode in the Winter Treat series and Chef Scott Richardson is cooking some nourishing winter dishes including duck breast glazed with quince paste, venison with mushroom croquette and poached pear and red wine syrup and finally an almond and vanilla cake. We hope you enjoyed this series and if you'd like any of the Winter Treats recipes check out the details at the end of the show. Welcome back to the kitchen with our winter treat series. Of course, pretty soon is going to be duck shooting season or duck hunting season, so I thought it was really relevant to do a duck dish. It's a bit fancy, but we know people are always looking for recipes to actually um, cook their duck or to make their duck with, so this is a, quite a nice one. So what I'm going to do is start off with a duck breast. So skin on. What I want to do is I want to score the actual skin. So when we actually render the fat down, it's actually going to get in between the, the skin. So I'm just scoring it with the tip of my knife, just cutting into that flesh, just to make some score marks. And then I want to rub in a wee bit of sea salt. Now you could put this straight into the fry pan and, it's, and the fat will actually render out. Or I'm actually going to be using some of the um, avocado oil from the olive grove actually in the salad that I'm serving this with. So I'm actually going to fry it in a wee bit of the oil as well. So I've just put it into my very hot pan because we want that nice and hot. And in goes our duck breast with the skin side down first. So we want that skin to actually get nice and caramelised and become nice and crispy as well. Now what I've got set up here is an oven tray with a cooling rack on top. And I'm actually going to sit the duck breast on that to put it into the oven to roast to finish off. We're just doing the skin, getting the skin nice and crispy and then we'll finish roasting it off in the oven. By doing this as well, any excess fat and juice is going to leak into the tray and keep our breast really nice. So we still want to turn it over and do the other side as well. As you can see, I've got a bit of colour into that, the scoring's there as well. Still on a relatively high heat. Just turn that back over onto that skin side. And I'll just basically start looking at our salad ingredients. So I'm using some baby rocket. Um, you could use watercress if you've got access to watercress. But these nice little rocket leaves are ideal for the salad. So in goes that rocket. Doesn't need to be um, washed. You have a little look as you're putting it into your bowl. I mean, for example, there, a bit of a herb that you don't want in there. But basically, it doesn't need to be washed. So there's our, our rocket ready to go. We'll just look at our duck breast again. There we go, getting some nice colour into that. Now if you didn't want to set up this arrangement, you could just put your whole fry pan into the oven to finish roasting it. Remember though, if your fry pan's got any plastic or wood on it, it's going to burn. This metal one will be fine. So I'm going to take mine off though and put it into, or onto the rack and then into the oven. Now we want to serve our duck nice and medium rare, so that's not going to take too long at all. But what I need to do first is actually take that back out of the oven because I missed one of our vital ingredients, was our quince paste. So this is what you buy in the supermarket. Quince paste, ready to go. You want to take a nice dollop of it, and actually it is a paste, and you want to sit that on top of the duck breast and that's going to melt into that and add that wonderful flavour. And we can go back and add some more of that as we um, need to. So back to our, little, our salad we're going to serve with it. So here's our, back to our rocket, all ready to go. I've got some fennel bulb. If you're not familiar with fennel bulb, so you're all familiar maybe with fennel, the herb, which grows out the end of this. This is the actual bulb from the base. A nice aniseed flavour. I've got a nice little um, Japanese mandolin here that's very sharp, so what we want to do is we want to slice our fennel. So you can see, look at those wonderful little slices. I picked this up in Japan when I was there last year from the equivalent of their $2 shops. It only cost $2, and look how wonderful that slices that fennel bowl. So it's got a nice little aniseed flavour. It's going to add nice crunch to our duck. Just need a wee bit more out of the other one. So there's no guard on this, so you've got to watch your fingers. Keep them out of the way. So 
So there's our wonderful fennel. So that in goes with the rocket. And then I've done some ruby grapefruit segments. So I've just segmented the grapefruit and these go in as well. So again, if you think of some classical duck dishes, duck a la orange, of course it has orange segments. So we're just updating that a wee bit and using the, the grapefruit. We're going to put a wee bit of that grapefruit juice on top because that can form part of our dressing. And as I said, I actually fried some of the, the duck in the avocado oil. So we're going to add a wee bit of that to it as well. And the two of those together, our oil and our vinegar, is going to create our dressing. If you didn't have that, just normal olive oil will be fine. Um, if you didn't have grapefruit, you could use orange segments. So I've given you a base to sort of work with. So we just want to toss those ingredients around and get them all coated in the oil and the grapefruit juice. So that's our salad ready to go. Let's put that to the side. We'll bring our plate over. And we'll bring over our duck breast that I've had resting. So this is one that I've done earlier on. So you might be able to see, we've actually got some juices that have come out. So as that's rested, the juices have come out, and then they've also gone back into the duck as well. So we've got our salad, which we're going to plate up on our plate. So you can see the nice contrast of the rocket with the fennel and then those wonderful grapefruit segments. Just picking a few more of those out. We can go on the top. Then we can take our, our duck breast and then we can slice it into nice slices. Still nice and juicy, still nice and pink. Bring that a bit closer, and then we can just lay our duck over the top. And if you wanted to, you could then put a wee bit more of the duck, uh, sorry, the quince paste. And what I would do is take it out, and I would just, because it is a paste, just chop that into some little slices as well. And if you do them thin enough, then they'll again will just slowly melt into that duck that you've set on top of the salad. So there you have it. There is our wonderful quince glazed duck breast sitting on our rocket fennel and grapefruit salad. Try that with the duck you're going to go and catch this duck hunting season and enjoy it.